Kamala Harris, if elected, would likely pursue a foreign policy that aligns closely with the current Biden administration's approach. This suggests a return to a more traditional and predictable foreign policy. Harris has expressed strong support for Israel and a commitment to diplomacy in the Middle East. Her stance on China is expected to be firm but measured, prioritizing dialogue and cooperation while addressing areas of concern. Harris has criticized China's human rights record and aggressive actions in the South China Sea. Most analysts believe that a Harris presidency would not represent a radical departure from the current trajectory of US foreign policy. Her experience as vice president and her deep involvement in foreign policy discussions within the Biden administration suggest a sense of continuity. Section four, what the experts say. Experts are divided on the potential impact of a Trump or Harris presidency. Some warn that Trump's return could usher in a period of global instability. They point to his unpredictable nature and his willingness to disregard established norms as recipes for chaos. Others believe that Trump's foreign policy, while unorthodox, was ultimately successful in advancing American interests. They argue that his tough stance on trade and his willingness to challenge China were long overdue. There is greater consensus on Harris's likely approach. Most experts predict a return to a more traditional and multilateral foreign policy. However, some question whether she will be able to effectively address the challenges posed by a rising China and a resurgent Russia. Section 5, a fork in the road. The 2024 election presents a stark choice for the world. A Trump victory would signal a return to an America first agenda, potentially upending decades of established global order. It could strain alliances and embolden adversaries. A Harris presidency, on the other hand, would likely mean a continuation of the current trajectory. This approach emphasizes diplomacy, multilateralism, and a commitment to international institutions. It seeks to restore American leadership within a rules-based global order. The choice between these two visions will have profound consequences. It will determine the future of global alliances, the direction of international cooperation, and the overall stability of the international system. Section 6. The world holds its breath. As the US election draws near, the world watches with a mixture of anxiety and anticipation. The outcome will have far-reaching implications for global peace and security. The stakes are high and the choices are clear. The world is hoping for a US president who will embrace cooperation, uphold international law and work to address shared challenges. The future of global order may very well depend on it.